Why does the ground suddenly shake and rumble, sometimes causing much destruction? It's like Mother Earth is groaning or shuffling around, a phenomenon we call an earthquake. At the heart of the Earth, deep beneath our feet, lies a powerhouse called the tectonic plates. Imagine these plates like giant cookie pieces floating on a big pot of molten chocolate. These cookie pieces keep moving, bumping into each other, pulling apart, or sliding alongside. Sometimes, they get stuck and build up pressure, like two wrestlers stuck in a stalemate. Now, how does an earthquake happen? Picture this. You've been pulling on a rubber band, and suddenly it snaps. That rubber band is like the energy being stored as tectonic plates attempt to move. When the pressure gets too much for the plates to handle, snap. They break free. The energy gets released in waves and travels through the earth, causing the ground to shake. The most common kind of earthquake originates along these lines where the plates meet, called faults. Imagine ripping a piece of paper. The edges that rip are similar to faults. As plates slip past each other, they cause vibrations or seismic waves, kind of like ripples spreading if you drop a pebble in a pond. That's what shakes the earth. There are different types of seismic waves, just like how waves come in different shapes and sizes at the beach. Body waves move inside the Earth, and surface waves roll along the surface like ocean waves. Is there something special that makes earthquakes scary and surprising? Absolutely. We never know exactly when or where they'll happen due to the unpredictable behavior of the plates beneath us. Knowing about earthquakes helps scientists and engineers improve buildings and ensure safety. It's like superheroes using their powers to protect the city from unexpected rumbles. So next time you hear news about an earthquake, you'll have an idea of the grand invisible dance happening beneath our feet and just how mighty those plates are in shaping our world.